everybody welcome back to my channel this is feline and if we are not rving we are eating thank you so much and for today's video i am going to show you this is a filipino delicacy they call it tulingan um this is boiled tulingan for a few hours and this is the juice it's cooked by a vinegar and salt and more and this is our appetizer this is a papaya salad or pickled papaya and then this is a also fried tulingan so so I am going to share with you this and I have my fried rice this uh, food because this food is my favorite 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 long time ago when I was in the Philippines so this is like Filipino fish Filipino food I'm gonna share to you guys and in case you're wondering why I'm not speaking Tagalog because I want to introduce our Filipino food to the world and this is um, this is very soft and then we put it in dip it in the sauce and then eat it like this like this So this is just only tasting. I am introducing you when I was a kid. This is my favorite fish because <clears throat> in the Philippines, this is cheaper a long time ago. And this is by far like tons of tons of um, ships or um, boats that will come in and then they will have a lot of this one. I ordered this, it's already fried because um, since I have an American husband he don't like the smell of this one and as a respect as a Filipino wife I know my husband let me cook we I cook my stuff outside and it's stinky so as a respect I cook my food outside especially this fish and we also have other kind of fish and since I miss the Philippines Mm. this food is my um, one of my favorite that I miss in the Philippines since we are here in the United States and my husband just let me buy this and I figure I should buy it cooked already and I'm very happy to introduce to you the Tulingan Queen in Florida her name is Marvik I will link her I will link her uh, Facebook page down below because she is very, she is the one who cooked this. She cooked all this fish and she make this uh, pickled salad or pickled papaya and it's really good. The reason why I'm sharing this is I'm just really grateful that I'm able to get the food that I really like here. In United States through Filipina so I connect with Filipinas and I'm sure if you have Filipina wife you also struggle the smell of the fish and that's why I bought it already cooked so my husband don't struggle it much <laughs> because I also I, I do care how it, it's just stinky though so let's try this one hmm? And she make for me the best achara that I ever had here in the United States. Now, if you are looking for this kind of fish, she have all this kind of fish and she have the smoke. I was not able to include the smoke one because the smoke is, I already eaten it. And I will show you this um this is vacuum seal and i did not reheat it 
I did not um, refry this. I just eat it like this because that's what my purpose is. And it's still really, really good. Like she preserved it pretty good. And yeah, so, so far this is really good. And it brings back my childhood. That's why I'm sharing you Filipino food and Filipino delicacies. And I will be sharing more and with the backstory about it. So at least you will enjoy and you will understand our culture and Filipino food. Thank you. You have a wonderful day. I will link down below the Tulingan Queen where you can buy if you are Filipino watching right now. You're looking for this kind of uh, fish, the Tulingan. You can actually buy it from her and just message her. And this is by far the best Tulingan I ever have here in the United States. Thank you very much. Bye.